All right, before the video starts, I think I want to make an announcement that we're going to be doing robot ratings a little bit differently from now on because we're just so far behind that there's no way of catching up. So I think from now on, I think whenever I record, I'll try to post as much as possible. But whenever I record, I will just go up from now. So then uh, we will still see the, the newest content, right? So anyways, but to begin with today, though, I mean, I, I hope you guys don't have any problem with that because I think that's. As best as we could do without making a sauce page, like like a like a voting page for which ones should make the cut, right? We could also do that. So let me know if we want to do this, where like we just go up, or we can do where there will be a voting page where, however many, whatever posts gets a lot of certain votes gets to be in the video, right? Okay, but anyways, to begin with today, though we do have, uh. 675c and we have uh we have their 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 robot and their rate reduction page so i would definitely check this out highly recommend this it's actually really nice so shout out to huge shout out to to 675c for making a page with all the weights of of the element of the game of the game stuff of the the parts so that's nice all right so if you want to know how much how much robot uh it's estimated to weigh in CAD or whatever, then you can just do this, right? And you can calculate it. But anyways, I want to take a look at the robot too, of course. They have this very nice joinker, right? So you can see here that they have a hook here and they have a, they have a uh, this is like a wall glider, right? With using a, a screw joint for, and a, and a sprocket with chain on it. I feel like you could get away with just doing like poly here, right? Poly, uh, kind of a poly semi-circle here, but this looks good too. And they can keep driving it into the goal to tip goals over, right? So that's pretty nice. This is definitely an S tier. Is the edit bad? All right, <laughs> clean as Vex field. It's pretty clean. Um, <laughs> that's, that's cooked. I'm gonna give this. I'm gonna give this a D tier. Day three rebuild. Is this for? The, I guess this is for the for the world's rebuild. Looks looks nice. It's definitely still seeing seeing Lady Brown from from here, right? But you know, can I say? It is what it is. I do feel like where he has this bar could be a little bit too far forwards, right? On our bots, we have been doing a thing where we have three 36 teeth, right? But so then our our bot our last two wheels are kind of offset, but still we have three 36 teeth, so then we can move this this C channel backwards. Let's see, another lady brown. Their their basket is facing facing the other direction, so then their ring kind of is in a weird orientation when they score, but I mean I think that probably helps with loading a bit. Interesting. I forgot to rate these. I'm gonna give this a B tier and this a B tier too. And went five and three in quals and then lost in quarters. Still made worlds off skills. That's nice. That's cool. I like the I like the decals on here. That's cool. I'm gonna give this a B tier as well. We're gonna go down and just finish up all the new ones to be honest. I'll add some connection points later. Yeah, this looks look a pretty standard robot again. We have the these are nice though, like to slide on the ground. I mean, you don't need them because if you want, you can just hard stop it, right? Because I feel like we like to use zip ties to hard stop things. Like we can we tie it to something uh higher, so then it hard stops very nicely. But I'm gonna give this an A tier. We have a a Minecraft CAD. I think they did a scan, a scan, and they were able to import that 3D model into to Minecraft. That's cool. That's an S tier. Optimal loading position. Shoot. Mm. <laughs> Maybe day five. Another, another Lady Brown CAD. Everyone's. I mean, it's always just Lady Browns. That's all good though. But I do like how they're connecting their their outer Lady Brown chassis to their inner intake chassis so that's highly recommended right however they did kind of extend this out right there they, they have a drilled 
standoff. That's kind of weird, but you know, that, that, I think, I think that's us uh, pretty cool though. So this is definitely how, what you want to do, right? I mean, ours is connected directly from the outer and onto the inner, right? But I guess there's it has to be out, offsetted because of the, of the motor and the gears. Excuse me, I just had to sneeze. But anyways, oh shoot, gotta read this one too. I'm gonna give this an eight tier, and this one eight tier. Okay, let's go up. Skills run. Skills run are honestly too 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 much time. But we will we'll watch this one. Yeah, I think honestly, I think like. The safest thing to do is just to run double plays route. And you can cut off the, the end and instead of doing the the blue ring here on that on that goal and then the, the blue and red here, I would just uh, do the red ring on that goal and then maybe if you have time you can consider doing like the blue ring here or just going for hang right away. So it's a 62 or 63 right so overall this looks pretty pretty nice. I think there's not really any like mistakes, right? Yeah. Oh, they went for, they went for. Oh, you he, he hit the blue ring too on that on that. But yeah, if you have if you don't have that red ring scored, just don't go for that blue ring, right? Because yeah, he doesn't have these red rings scored. So here you definitely want to run if because if, if he's doing that that top ring there, that, that's a blue ring. Definitely want to run the the route where you clear those two rings like further in. So you, so at the start here. You would want to go further in to grab the goal or the ring for the Lady Brown, right? And score two on the wall stake. So, one way to do that well is to at the uh, is to because if you don't have a a two motor intake like a 5.5 uh, 11, then you just have if you have it connected right, then you want to grab a ring, like and just like have it barely go into your intake, just sitting like on the bottom. So then you can grab this one as well. So, just a little tip. But yeah. Top stake plus wall stake, Lady Brown work in progress. That's cool. It's like a a Lady Brown high hang. That's very interesting. Let's see. So they have this, this joint pivot up here, which is pulled by this piston. And I wonder how that sits when they're unexpanded. Do they show? I don't know. Oh, it's like this. Yeah, I guess it's still pretty 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 like compact but where's the lady brown the lady brown is kind of that's whack that, that that's a very strange setup there i feel like i feel like why not just have it fully connected like a full c channel here maybe they have their they have their reasons but yeah i don't like how it's not it's like that i feel like that could snap but about the the tier three Oh, I see. That makes so much more sense now. Yeah, sorry for being a little slow there. But they fold this this piece. The, the Lady Brown, they fold the Lady Brown, right, to score that top stake. I like that. That's smart. This is getting an S tier. And they have a piston for the for the intake to, so then they can, they can hang on the front. Wow, this is really cool. I I like this. Hmm. Yeah, this is this is interesting. Let me look at let me look, think about the ex, ex, uh, expansion. I don't think there'd be any expansion issues either because they only expand forwards, right? All right, this is definitely this is definitely something that I'm keeping a watch out on. This is this looks really nice because I think with how back their winch is, you can possibly even do hang with goal, right? This looks nice. I like this. S tier, work in progress drivetrain. Nice. I like the the mo ver vertical motors. They look pretty cool, right? Saves a lot of space. You can make your drivetrain really short that way. I think this is twenty five. Damn, that's short. It's getting an A tier or B tier actually. Suggestions. Suggestions. Uh, honestly, this looks nice. You know, he had his bottom brace, or he has his uh, chassis brace on the bottom. So then he kind of have your hooks go as low as possible. Right, for a quick pickup so i like that yeah this looks nice it's getting a it's gonna be tier as well and then we have b score as well so many things that people have been working on recently bam just shoots it off but yeah that's it
Thank you guys.